now, Cinevasaurus Rex presents five monster-sized facts about Godzilla vs. Destroyer! Well, kicking things off, Toho plan to release his film as Godzilla vs. Destroyer, but copying right the word Destroyer kind of proved to be a bit difficult, so they then instead renamed him to Destroyer. Then, when Toho had the movie dubbed in English, they made sure that the, everyone called it Destroyer because that was the original intended name. Now, this was a bit of a send-off for Godzilla and it was actually intended to be the last Godzilla film up until 2004. The plan was to allow Tristar to make a Godzilla trilogy of their own featuring Matthew Broderick. And because of the overwhelming success of Godzilla in 1998, <clears throat> and because of the piece of shit that came out in 1998, the sequels were immediately scrapped and Toho needed to rewrite what had just been fucked up and brought out Godzilla 2000. Now an alternate ending was filmed for this, where Godzilla and Destroyer melt at the same time and the alternate ending is seen on the DVD and for you lucky folks that are watching this here's just a little sneak preview of what's happening it should be on your screens about now now an original idea for this movie actually had Godzilla fighting the original 1954 Godzilla so it was going to be called Godzilla vs Ghost Godzilla but the idea was scrapped because they thought Godzilla didn't need to fight three clones in a row because he went Mecha Godzilla and Space Godzilla and Ghost Godzilla were just one step too far from him. Um, I think it could have been interesting, but I'm glad they went with the Destroyer. And finally, as uh, we all know, Godzilla's Destroyer ended on a very sad and somber note and it was, you know, quite eerie watching Godzilla kind of die and well he was supposed to lay dormant in Toho's mind for another 10 years as well so it would have been really sad and the people at Toho actually held a funeral for Godzilla. Now they didn't specify how big the coffin was or whether it was a cremation or a burial or if you can go visit his tombstone or anything like that but all we know is that Toho held a funeral for Godzilla and that's a very very sad thing. Now, next Thursday it's going to be a Halloween kind of thing, so no five facts about Godzilla. Our next five facts is two weeks, and it'll be five facts about Zilla 1998. Have a good weekend, folks, and happy Halloween. Yeah.